yeah. are you that? I cannot explain the amount of stress I've been through because of this pandemic. And usually when I'm stressed out, I find something to relieve the stress, whether it's skydiving, bungee jumping, dyeing my hair, cutting my hair, exploring different countries, meeting new people. But because of this pandemic, it's kind of hard for me to do that stuff. So because of that, I decided I might get a tattoo that I know is going to fade away. I'm ready. Welcome to Ephemeral. Located in Williamsburg, an ephemeral tattoo are made with a revolutionary ink that is designed to fade. The tattoos last between 9 and 15 months depending on how well you take care of it. The process is the exact way as a traditional tattoo with a needle and a tattoo machine minus a lifelong commitment. I worked with Naomi on my design and as you can see right here, she is putting the stencil on me. I'm kind of nervous because I never experienced this before but let's see how it goes. Okay. Is it less painful than a tattoo or is it the same pain? I would say they're very comparable in pain. The process is pretty similar. This one's just a bit of a slower piece process. I would tell you if you do plan on getting a traditional permanent tattoo, that if you go for traditional shading, that will hurt more. Is what I'm getting right now traditional shading? No. Oh, okay. You're getting stippling shading with heavy line work. Not heavy line work in thickness, just like all the The tattoo I decided to go with was a tree and a list of all my accomplishments. I chose a tree because when people look at a tree, they don't think nothing of it. But what our eyes cannot see is how powerful and important a tree is. A tree becomes more powerful as they age and provides the necessities of life. Trees are also underestimated and undervalued. And that's how I see myself. And looking at me, it don't seem like much, but what I do and provide for others is powerful. The little words represent all my accomplishments and certifications. So the BS stands for it's my degree. The PMP stands for the project management professional certification I was able to, to obtain. The DSLR is for cameras and videos because that's something I like to do and hope to continue to do. The WW stands for worldwide. I am a world traveler and my biggest accomplishment was travel to 22 countries within three years. I first left the country in 2016 and since then I've been to 22. The music notes me as a musician. I play five instruments and ACP is my certification that I'm obtaining next.